Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jada and this is Jada Lee Budgets. On this channel I do weekly cash stuffings, weekly cash unstuffings, and quarterly sinking fund updates and cash condensing videos. Today we are going to be stuffing the second paycheck of April, which is Adam's paycheck. Um, he got paid a total of $1,803. The VA check added $295 to that, so we had $2,098 to work with for this week. After our bills and expenses, we are stuffing $1,187, and we are going to jump right into our cash envelopes. Let me see if I have any change left first. How's everyone's weeks going? Oh, just one coin. Ours has been a little hectic, um, but I am done with my big papers for this quarter, or sorry, for this semester. So I'm feeling very relieved, but work has been crazy. So that has been a thing, but oh, we made it through. It's Friday, I'm filming this right before I'm gonna post it. Um, and I'm just so excited for the weekend. Um, groceries has $1 left, it's getting 125. And that's all that it has. My gas has five, six, seven, eight dollars left. We'll take that out and it's getting 45. So that's all that gas has. Fun has 10, 11, 12. That 10 is gonna go to activities and the dollars will go to buffer. Um, fun is getting 125 as well. So that's 50, 70, 90, 110, 120, 125. We do have some plans this weekend. We're gonna go see a movie, The First Omen. We love scary movies and our two best friends that live in the same building as us, they love scary movies too. So we're going to see that with them. And then we're beforehand, we're going to get um, drinks and food at this new restaurant that they have in Kansas City because we're trying to do something new every weekend during the nicer months this year. Um, so that's our new thing that we're doing this weekend. Um, miscellaneous has five, six, seven, eight, nine dollars left. Is that right? I guess so. Um, it is getting 32. So 20, 30, one, two. Give is getting five and that is all that give will have. My wallet is done. Now we'll jump to Adam's. So Adam's Hobbies has 20, 30, 35, 36. We're gonna take the $6 out and add 50. So now he has 50, 70, 80 in his hobbies. His miscellaneous is getting 20. He's, he does get 30 a week, but $10 just goes on his debit card. I did get that right, yes, okay. And then his gas always gets 25. Okay, let's see what we have. So left over, we have 10, 15, 20, 25, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 36 left over. Nice. And now we'll jump into our revolving funds binder. So date night is getting $10, and that is all it will have. Beauty is getting 15. So it has 10, 20, 25, 30. I need to bulk this up a little bit. Next week I'm supposed to get a bonus, so um, probably put a little more in there next week. Gifts is getting five. So it has 20, 30, 35, 40, 45. It is my friend's birthday today. Um, so I did 
just send them some money to get drinks for their birthday. So that'll be coming out in the cash on stuffing next week. Um, my gifts is getting five. So it has 50, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95. Adam's gifts is also getting five. So his has 50, 70, 75, 80. My personal is getting 10. So now it has 20, 30, 40, 45. And then Adam's personal is also getting 10. So now it has 20, 30, 40, 45 as well. Activities, we budgeted five, but, oh, it's got a dollar in here. We're gonna take this 10 that we had left over from fun and put that in there as well. So now activities has 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Our buffer is getting 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, oops, 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 27. So now our buffer has 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 71. 71 in buffer. This money in the front is just um, for when I go down to part time. If we ever have a week where we don't have enough funds, that is what that money in the front is for. Now we'll go into our long-term funds. So home is getting five. A lot of these are getting five. So home now has 100, 5, 10, 15. And this is for home decor or decorations. Um, duh, that's what decor means. I meant like holiday decorations. Um, that's what our home envelope is for. It's not for like buying a home. Our medical is getting 10. So now it has 500 in the bank, 20, 30, 40, 540. Stella and Olive are getting 10. So now they have 100, 200, 300, 10, 25, 325. Car maintenance is getting 10. So now it has 100, 200, 250, 270, 280, 290, 295. Car tags is getting 15. So now it has 100, 200, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. 240 in car tags. Christmas is getting 20 as usual. So Christmas now has 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, 310, and 320. Travel is getting 50. So travel now has 100, 200, 300, 400, 450, 500, 550, 560. I am going back home to Illinois next weekend to have a girls weekend with my girlfriends. Um, so that is what that money is going towards next. Tattoos is getting five. So it has 100, 200, 250, 260, 265, 270. And tattoos. And that does it for our long-term funds. And for our savings binder. Emergency is getting 250, gets 250 every week. 
So emergency now has 1,000, 2,000, 100, 200 in the bank. Three, four, five, six hundred, six fifty, seven hundred. So two thousand seven hundred in emergency. Okay. Student loans is getting fifty. So now it has a hundred. Wedding is getting a hundred. So now wedding has 100, 150, 70, 90, 210, 220, 225 in wedding. And that does it for our savings. And then the last thing we have is our 100 envelope challenge. So last week we pulled envelope number 82 and 85, and we're just going to be stuffing 85 for both. That's 50, 70, 85, and 50, 70, 85, so it's a total of 170. So um, in total now, between what we already paid towards the ring and what we have in cash, we have contributed 2,185. I think either 185 or 115. I don't know. I can't really read that. Um, <laughs> we have contributed that to the 100 envelope challenge so far this year, which is incredible. And now we will go ahead and choose our envelopes for next week. I am allocating $200. So we're just going to find envelopes that equal to 200. I'd like to knock the 100, the 100 envelope out of the way first. Oh, let me mark these off too. We had 82 and 85 this week, right? Yes. Okay, so let me see if I can find the 100. In here, they're not in order. Oh, my goodness! Hello, I'm also going to see if I can find the 98 because we'll just round that up to 100 and then that'll be our 200 for next week. Sorry, this is probably not very fun to watch. <laughs> um, I swear if it's not in here. I need the 98 and the 100. Oh, here's 100. Oh, and here's 98. They're right next to each other. Wonderful. <laughs> Okay, so 198, those are the ones that we're doing next week. Look at that, guys. We're almost halfway done. That is so exciting. 98, cool. So there's still quite a few bigger ones, but I want to try and save all of these lower ones for the end of the year when I'm down to part time. So hopefully we'll be able to swing that. Let me put this up here and 98, which is going to be 100. So we're doing 200 for 100 envelope challenge next week. Okay. All right, y'all, that is going to do it for this week's video. Thank you so, so much for watching. I will see you next week with our cash unstuffing for this week and our third paycheck of April, which will be my paycheck, which will include my bonus on it. I didn't get as high of a bonus as I got the last two quarters um, just because my productivity, I still met my productivity. Otherwise, I wouldn't get... A bonus but I just didn't 
go high enough in my percentage to get the $1,500 bonus. So I'm getting a $750 bonus, which after taxes, I'm hoping will be around like four fifty, dollars but we'll see. Um, so yeah, anyway, I will see you all next week. I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. Thank you so much for watching.